All right, 20 military service members from 10 countries became U.S. citizens this morning in a naturalization ceremony aboard the USS Midway. Incredible, right? Well, KUSI's Allie Wagner has our story. U.S. naturalization ceremonies take place every month across America, including here in San Diego. This one not only special because it's aboard the USS Midway Museum on the Friday before 4th of July, but the ceremony for 20 military service members from 10 different countries, including the Philippines, which is where 21-year-old Jerusha Israel is from. It's I'm a little nervous because there's a lot of like cameras everywhere and a lot of like important people, but I'm also really excited because it's been like 11 years since I've been here. So it's nice to like finally become a U.S. citizen and feel like a true American. <laughs> uh, I feel like I don't know really how to explain it. I mean, as of right now, I'm really nervous. As you can see, I'm shaking, but um, it's just excitement. Uh, it's always something that also my mom wanted for me too as well. Um, a better life, better opportunities, um, just grow better. So it's really an important thing for me, a really big thing, a really a, a big accomplishment. That dream now a reality. Diego Lozano Hernandez. For many of these men and women, they look forward to being able to continue to serve this great country. I'm excited because it means I can re-enlist and continue with my career as a Marine and serve this beautiful country. I wanted to join the Marine Corps because I didn't want to be in like a regular lifestyle. I wanted to be something more like to serve the country. I wanted to travel around the world and protect and defend my people. I love the freedom. I love the security that they provide, the education that you cannot see anywhere else. From the USS Midway Museum, I'm Allie Wagner, KUSI News.